I've never seen a waterfall so big. Boy. Yes, sir. Hey, it's another treasure map. Not good either. One more for the collection. me, God of Thunder! Your challenges mean nothing to the God, Spirit. They do not listen. Do not mock my pursuit of vengeance. Though my family devoted their lives to worshipping Thor, I've devoted mine to his downfall. And I will start with that statue looming over my father's grave. Unlikely. You are dead. Is there something we can do? For a reward, of course. If you bring down the statue... You have my blessing to loot my father's grave. He rests on an island to the east. Why do you hate Thor so much? After my father passed, my mother built the statue to watch over his grave. Imagine our surprise when the God of Thunder himself came to offer condolences. At first we were thrilled, but he quickly took advantage of our hospitality. My mother begged him to leave, and Thor, in his drunken rage, killed her. I was left with nothing but grief. Eventually, I lost that as well, and found only rage in its place. I... I'm so sorry. Come, boy. We have a statue to destroy. My father's grave lies on an island to the east. Do not mistake my mother's statue of Thor with that monstrous eyesore to the south.
can't believe Odin and Freya were ever married. Wow. Begin to build statues this big. Dwarves are resourceful creatures. Annoying, but resourceful. I guess they must have been pretty important dwarves. saying Thor is half god and half giant? That's so weird. Aye, but Odin and Fjordun's love was true. Once Fjordun was gone, lonely ages passed for Odin. And as war with the Vanir raged, I could see what he really wanted beneath his bluster. And after no small amount of convincing, Freya agreed. For a while there, he really turned on the charm. He seemed happy. He seemed interested in making her happy. He granted us so many wishes, I can scarcely recall them all. The peace held, and I truly believe. Here it is. It's got to have a weak point. Somewhere. Get away from it! planning on doing this himself. <gasps> Easily, boy. 
I know, I know. I was just joking. Nor are they a joking matter. Sorry. Father, why did the gods cause so much trouble for us? Because that is their nature. But with all that power, you would think at least some of them would try to make life better for people. And yet, the gods continue to spread misery. Sadly, despite his wise counselor's best efforts to persuade him that peace was the only true path to stave off Ragnarok, Odin never let go of his obsession with Jotunheim. But I can just tell you the story later. you stands no longer, spirit. Then my bond to this realm is severed, and I am off to find the real god of thunder. He will know retribution. My deepest gratitude. Off he goes. Brave guy. Want to look for Thor on his own. He is a fool. What? What did the spirit leave us? An offering to one of the gods. Can we use it? No. But perhaps the dwarves can. 